Friday night lights ending in gunfire. Today, the Oklahoma County Sheriff releasing new information saying an off-duty Dell City police officer shot a 42-year-old man in the chest. He is in the ICU. And family tells us news for 16-year-old Corday Carter was also shot by someone else and killed. News Force Caitlin Ogle is live at Midwest City High School where the victim went to school in Caitlin. Do you know the latest on this investigation today? Well, actually, Jolene, Choctaw police just showed up to Midwest City High School just a couple of minutes ago. They drove by and investigators are saying they're working two cases here, the homicide and the officer involved shooting. A student tells me Corday concert Con Carter was a nice guy who loved to talk about music. He was just a cool guy. Third quarter of the Friday night Choctaw Dell City football game. <laughs> Suddenly gunshots, chaos and adrenaline. This is an argument that broke out that people chose to uh, involve weapons. I don't know what the argument was about. One of the bullets hitting and killing Corday Carter, a 16 year old student at Midwest City High School. He would mostly talk about music, other things that he liked to do. Good student as well. Another striking a young girl in the leg. She was treated and released. Monday, Oklahoma County Sheriff Tommy Johnson III says along with Choctaw officers, two off-duty Dell City officers were working security. Our investigation shows the Dell City officer did shoot a 42-year-old man in the chest. That remains in critical condition at this time. The officer received or perceived some sort of threat. Our school superintendent was directly involved in saving his life. The school uh, safety administration along with his brother, who's a trauma surgeon, were working on that man. Now he and another off-duty officer are on paid administrative leave. This is a critical incident. I need him time to decompress and also be ready to interview with the sheriff's office and cooperate fully. Right now, it's not clear if the victims were involved in the argument or simply caught in the crossfire. Meanwhile, police say they're still searching for a suspect. I don't believe the public's in danger um, at all. Investigators say they found two guns and eight rounds at the scene and the sheriff's office says both sides are still investigating. And if you happen to have been at the game and have any video or pictures of the shooting or the aftermath, they want you to upload those at their website and I'll have a link over on KFOR.com. We're live in Midwest City, Caitlin Ogle, Oklahoma's News 4. Thank you, Caitlin.